All aboard! The New York Knicks are playoff bound and the playoff train is getting ready here on the Return of the Knicks podcast here on the Sports Jedi Network. Salute everyone. We are the Dons of the Watch Along. My, let me introduce myself. BX Sports Jedi Kev and the one and only the Michelin Megastar Chef Dan. Buena noche. Salute. We are playoff bound, Chef Dan. We clinched. Clinched like, never mind. You know what? I, I'll leave those jokes to you. You go ahead. Say a clinch. Hey. Go ahead, Jedi. I'll let you say it. We clinch now, like what? Oh, man. We clinch like a old man in cold water quickly. Man. But you know what? Ladies and gentlemen, I say well, you guys, don't, you, those guys don't play. What the hell do you say we? Because we invest our love, our our time, our passion to follow this team from every bounce of the basketball, every up and running down the court, every – Ups and downs, wins, losses, injuries, non-injuries. Um, we're proud to wear the orange and blue um, and root for this laundry, this team. And when we say we, because we feel connected with this team, with a group of guys, um, with all they persevere. And, yes, we like to say that, proud, that I know we is easy, but you know what? Yeah, we win and lose together as a team because we do suffer those losses when they do. And um, what a great, great Regular season here for the Knicks, but there's still two games. There's still the story has not completed for the 2024 season. Let's try to finish here because right now we sit at looking at third place in the Eastern Conference. Where possibility with tonight a win against the Celtics with two left um, to clinch one more game to clinch that third seed. Wow. And we, and, and the second seed is not far off either. Milwaukee we could snip on a banana peel here against Orlando. Orlando's fighting, so they don't have a, a easy task at hand. Uh, and of course, we'll get to the to the chat in a moment. But Chef Dan, where this is 
wow. I mean, if I would have told you we're here close to second seed in the Eastern Conference with two, three games to remain, I think people say you must be delusional or a homer. Um, if you told me that at the beginning of the season, I would have believed you. Now, had you told me that at the beginning of the season and then said, hey, by the way, I'm going to let you know this. Julius Randle is going to be injured for a set number of games. We're going to trade for OG Ananobi, and then he's going to be injured for a set number of games. Oh, and by the way, you're going to be missing Mitchell Robinson for majority of the season. Then right there, I call you a liar and tell you, don't piss on me and tell me that it's raining. But we here. We're almost there, man. We can clinch. Clinch like what, Jedi? Oh, we could clinch like an old man in a pool, or you could clinch like clinch like like a cheapskate at a at a uh, at a restaurant when you give them the check. Like, I don't know, I don't know, I'm not or paying for this. Clinch like an inmate. Oh, Ooh, wow, wow, that's the last thing I thought about there. Um, by the way, rest in peace, O.J. Simpson. Oh, rest in peace, O.J. Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, everyone. <laughs> I mean, talk about inmate. I mean, okay. So let me get right. Let's get right back into this to this game. Welcome to everybody that's watching us for the first time here on all the different platforms. Um, we do a watch along. We do have a scoreboard. We do the play by play. We give you the call. We give you our analysis. We give you our thoughts. And we ask you to participate in the chat. We are a heavy, heavy, heavy pa chat participation program. We ask you to participate in the chat. Everyone's voice gets acknowledged, heard. It doesn't get ignored. You you get uh, uh, highlighted. We we also interact with the chat. You know, um, we we love the interaction. Like we want to say hello to Darnell Davis. I love Pi. Of course, the big task at hand. Who's talking to them? Talking them? Talking them? And of course, Gideon is in the building. And don't forget to hit that like button. It helps um, give us more recognition or. Shout, shout out with the Google network or the Google algorithm, and we ask you to hit that like you know, and and all that good stuff. Share it on your social media platforms, and thank you for being part of our family. All right, please so hit the like and subscribe. Please share it. So they're going right. I like this here. You know, sometimes you want a, 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 a quick kiss and get right to business, but that's what they're doing here on TNT. Usually they linger. If it's the regular season, they linger. They say yada yada. Everybody and their mothers got to talk about. Um, give analysis, but no, they're going right into it. Here's the starting lineup for the Celtics. It'll be Holiday, White, Brown, Tatum, and Porzingis. And, of course, our Knicks lineup is Brunson, DiVincenzo, Hart, Ananobi, and Harkestein. So the scoreboard is always about a minute a minute ahead. The Knicks are in their uh, city edition, not the city, their legacy uniforms and blue and orange, of course, and the Celtics are in that white and green and we're going to put the hardwood on the most ugliest hardwood floor in all the NBA. And we're off at Boston. And you can smell the shit from that city. Here we go. Here's Brown. Kicks it out to Porzingis. Porzingis back over to Tatum. Tatum looking. Tatum looking for Holiday. And it kicks out to Porzingis for three. And I know that was an air ball. Actually, that was a pass to Holiday. We could, okay. It wasn't pretty, but it was effective for the Celtics, just like the city. Now here is <laughs> here can, only thing good about Boston is the lobster roll. Here's the Vincenzo. Kicks it back here to Harkenstein. Harkenstein back to Brunson. On an Obi. On an Obi now driving. Oh, stolen by Tatum. Here's White the other way. White in transition. White spins. White where the all big head of his misses. Lollipop head misses. Watch out, watch out. Oh, no, no, but Ananobi got the ball back, kicks it out to DiVincenzo, wide open for three, and just like Death and Taxes, DiVincenzo hits it from downtown, nicks up three to two. Let's go, Dante, the big ragu. And the Knicks almost stole that ball from Brown. Brown back to Porzingis, Porzingis back to White, White top of the key, White now driving, kicks it back out, Brown, and Brown hits it. So good movement, ball movement from the Celtics here. They have a two-point lead here. 90 seconds gone by in the game. Here's Brunson. Brunson gets a screen for Ananobi now, guarded by Tatum. Now Brunson looking to dice here. Brunson between his legs. Resets here. Shot clock at eight. Now he's looking for a screen from Hart. Back to Hart. 
Hart now. Hart mid-range jumper from the elbow. Rubs in, and Harkinson was there, but he was fouled as Lemonhead picks up his first foul. Cool. Josh Hart. Either he, he got hit on his hand or he's using the universal sign for poop. Hopefully it was a hit on the hand or he just saw how bad he missed that shot and he's playing it off. I pray that's it. What's going on? Salute to you. Magellan in the building as misses the first free throw here. Mr. Agent Super Argo. Yes, light bulb head. That's the right call. Thank you, Agent, for helping me out there. I'm going to call it lemon head. It's a light bulb head. There you go. And he hits one of two from the line. And Boston's up by one. All right, here is light bulb head, a.k.a. White. So we go from a Kobe White to a Derek White. Back door to White. Holiday in the corner. Holiday misses. And loose ball right to the hands of Harkenstein. Boy, for $148 million a year. Ugh. Here we go, Brunson. Wow, Hart by himself. Hart underneath. Hart underneath. Layup is good. And the best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be underneath the basket. Here we go. Here's Brown. Brown kicks it back out of Porzingis. Porzingis top of the key to Tatum. Tatum now has to knock it away. He goes retrieve it. There's plenty of time on the shot clock. 13. Here's Porzingis to the top for three. Porzingis steps into it. Three-pointer. Porzingis. Now he opens up the court like an old, like an old man going for a colonoscopy. Here is Harkenstein back over here to Divincenzo. Divincenzo putting on moves. Divincenzo gives it to Harkenstein and that count it and one chance for a three point play to Isaiah Harkenstein. It's alive! It's alive! It's alive! The Jordan Delaware gets an assist on that play. Oh, goodness. I feel. <laughs> you see, this is the type of game, Chef Dan. We, you don't. In the, in the near future, you will never hear the uh, commentary on our next platform, on our next adventure as he misses the free throw here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Here's Derek White. White now looking for Brown. Brown fakes the jumper, driving, spins off the glass. It's good. So, Brown, composure there. Nice move to the basket. Two-point lead for Boston here. Now Hart back to the to Brunson. Jalen Brunson gets a screen. Brunson now working. Shot clock at 10. Now on the right side. G cuts mid-range off the... Oh, sweet. Agree with the agent. Don't trade baskets. Let's go. Here's Brown wants to go the other way in transition. Brown wants to get a screen, but Hart sticks with Brown. Kicks it back out of Tatum. Tatum thought about a three. Now Tatum driving. Tatum kicks it out to Porzingis. Porzingis fakes. Now gives it to Brown. Brown driving. Brown looking underneath to Tatum. Tatum kicks out to Holiday. Holiday now drives. Holiday kicks out to Brown. Brown with the butter fingers. Of course, I saw him eating that butter there, butter flavored popcorn, and he turns it over. Mr. Steven felt like the Mets are hot. They hit a couple grand slams today, Steven. I hope you're doing well. Here's Hart back over to Har Harkenstein. Here's Steven Chenso off the curl. Back to Harkenstein with the floater. It's good. It's alive. It's alive. Second consecutive assist for Steven Chenso. Nick's up by two. White back to Tatum. Tatum top of the key. Tatum now bounce pass here to Porzingis and Tatum. Oh, Jalen Brunson, but right to the hands of Tatum with adjusted in the air. So he had the loose ball found him and he adjusted in the air or don't leave it at twelve. So that's good, persistent, and sticking with your shot. Brunson, Hart. Hart now working on Porzingis. Now backing in on an OB now. OG now. Now driving to the basket. OG now going back. Up the glass. No, misses, but gets his own rebound. Kicks it back on to Hart. Reset. No, he's going to no. At the buzzer. It's good. Hart. I did not see the clock reset, and, the, and it was going down, and he shot the grenade into the barrel. Now Brown backing in. Brown backing in spins. Baseline. And counted and won. So Brown just cooked Hart there. At the heart, just hit a hell of a shot. So Brown has a chance for a three-point play. Bradle had the surgery. Ooh, I did not know that. Thanks for that update. Did not know that. Ooh. 
All right. Here we go. He misses the free throw, Chef. Oh, don't lie. Uh huh. There you go. We're only even at fourteen now. Seven minutes left in the in the quarter. Brunson on that logo now. Brunson steps in for three. That's off the mark. Rebound by Porzingis. So hand it off to Tatum. Here comes Tatum in transition. Tatum now. Tatum working on Ananobi. He'll reset here. He'll reset back again. Wants a high screen from Porzingis. He gets the screen. Now he pick and roll. No, he holds it. Shoots the long range jumper. No good. Loose ball. Loose ball. Right to the hands of Hart. Secures it. Hart got it poked away by White. Now Holiday to Porzingis now. Porzingis going at it. No good. Good defense by Harkenstein. Here's Hart. Kicks it off. It's Ananobi. Ananobi with the dunk is good. Beautiful. We get a nice assist. And Joe Mosula calls timeout. 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 Timeout by the Boston Celtics. Nick's up by two. Talk to them. To, talk to them. Big ties. Talk to them. Big ties. Talk to them. Harkenstein defending the defending the rim. I like that, Chef. That's a, a wonderful thing to see. So now I can't wait when Mitchell Robinson gets in here, how he's going to look against this team. Because that's Mitch coming off the bench now. And he's, you know, this is the way to get him acclimated because we see what he can do off the bench. Hopefully he goes out to eat some cookies, some get some rebounds and blocking some shots. Absolutely. Because if, if he could put on a game where he gets in their head on the rim protector, rebounding machine, Boston is going to be shook heading into the plow season. If you if they come, the Knicks to come here and do that, um, I'll rebound them and be physical up, up front in the front court. Yeah, that's a statement. Because if they come out here, Chef, and they shoot threes and they shoot lights out, they could say, you know what, analytic-wise, you're not really going to shoot the three ball that high all the time. We could work with that. But if you start shaking them with the rebounding offensive glass and putbacks and and and, and protecting the paint, they're gonna be like, uh oh. Because you can never like you could hey, you could ask any you could ask nine out of ten women, size matters. Yep. Mr. D Ooh. Ross. Kind of cool and collected. But also like that, like on their home four, we out hustle them. That too. Because everything you spoke about, that's positioning, that's, you know, that's positioning and effort. Absolutely. You know, I always said that. I'm always a big proponent when it comes to rebounding. It's, the, it's positioning and effort. Um, and, and, of course, size is the last thing because you could, you could see Hart, six foot six out there um, leading the NBA for guards and rebounding. And, and, and you don't see nothing. You don't do nothing malicious or nothing. He's just in right position and knows where to time. It, it's just an art. All right, so we have a commercial. He says, yeah, I hope, uh, I sure do hope Mitchell shows up tonight. Yes, indeed. I like that State Farm commercial. Oh, with the basketball? <laughs> yeah, with the WNBA player. Yeah. <laughs> the sympathizer. They should. They should do a, a show called the Colonizer. Mm -hmm. Rogue One is a Star Wars movie. Yes, indeed. Oh wait, wait. Oh, here we go. Uh, you know what, Big Task? I didn't see that quick question. I apologize. I'm going to be like, spaced out for a second. Um, have you ever heard, heard of... Yeah, that's the um, Star Wars movie with, with the... When they steal the plans of... Of course, anything Star Wars. I, I'm, I'm in there like a... Like, like, like Kobe White's head. Large. Yes, indeed. That was pretty good. That's where they steal the Death Star plans. And I'm of course, sorry, Jedi. I just got a I just got a notification across my timeline. What is it? What was it? Can you share? If not, that's cool. I wait till commercial. You got it. Here's Brown. Brown now. Brown stops that back dumper for three. No, no good. Rebound. Fight for it and snatch like a grown man. OG Ananobi took it away. Here's Brunson. Says, give me that. He 
Here's Brunson working. Brunson now slicing. Brunson in the paint. Turn around. Jumper for Brunson. He gets the Prosutis bounce. Beautiful. Knicks up by four. Here's White backing on DiVincenzo on the left side of the court. Now trying to go back in the middle and stolen by Ananobi. Now Ananobi now. Press break. Oh, G. Ananobi with the clamor jammer. Knicks up by six. What up, Seth? What's up? There you go, man, with the logos. I love it. And stolen by DiVincenzo. Now here comes Dante. Back-to-back -back steals for the Knicks. De and Brunson now. Brunson. He's going to stand in for three. That's off the mark. Rebound for Porzingis. Now Brown. Brown. Who's that? Not Brown. Here's Brown again. Driving. Layup. It's good. That's just his quickness. He just eluded. The uh, Harkenstein there off the dribble, 20 to, 20 to 16. Here's Jalen Brunson. Brunson working on the screen. Jalen now backing in, driving, stops. Hart lost it, but he got it back here. He's got Porzingis. He's going to reset here. He's going to give it over to DiVincenzo. Devo, mid-range jumper off, no good. Rebound right to the hands of White. Here's White. White now drives, stops on the skate, kicks it to Hartford, extra pass to Brown. Brown between his legs. Brown lost it, but but still keeps the dribble alive. Here he's driving. And that's got off with a push. Offensive foul going the other way. My God, you saw that. More extended than a man of Viagra. Let's go. What a nice play by OG Ananobi. And even the fan in the front row was happy. Look at that. It's 20 to 16 here. Let's go. Knicks will have the possession. Jalen Brunson, DiVincenzo, back to hard in the middle of the court. Back over down, hands it to Brunson. Brunson has Brown on the mismatch here. Wants a high screen as Cookie Monster. Mitchell Roberts is in. Now Brunson driving. Brunson stop. Kicks to DiVincenzo cutting. Oh, what a beautiful move by Dante in the air. Nice move, Delaware Jordan. 22 to 16. Four minutes here left. Now White. White wants to screen from Hartford. And White steps out for three. And he misses. Rebound by Onanobi. Onanobi now will give it to Brunson. Oh, Rangers are tied at 1-1. Thanks for that update. Rangers trying to get that President's Cup. There's Brunson off the glass. Jalen Brunson. Yeah. What are we witnessing here? A mega star. Yeah. Here's Brown. Brown kicks it back out. Here's the three. Hauser. Not Doogie. Sam hits it from downtown. 24-19. So here's Brunson now. Brunson. Brunson guarded by Hauser. Now Brunson looking to cook. Brunson got bumped there. No call. Mitchell Robinson with the offensive rebound, but he lost it. Going up. Knocked out his hands. Here comes Boston. Here's Hartford for three. And he got it. Al Hartford. Broken clock situation. Hits it from downtown. 24 to 22. And timeout on the floor by Tom Thibodeau and the Knicks. But this is the one thing the Knicks don't need. The tertiary players like a Harford, Hauser, you know, Buckus, they can't come in here and start hitting the three ball. No. Knicks got yeah. that Jedi. Yes. And also, Mitchell has to play stronger. Yeah. Maybe he like needs that. some. There, look at that. Oh, yeah. Whose game is it? Yeah. There you go. That's right, it's Jalen Brunson. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mitchell acting like a big man stole the ball from him. Mitchell need Mitchell, yeah. Mitchell probably needs a little bit of Josh Hart's milk. You know, his so so he could be strong and grab those rebounds. He's just gotta learn to keep his arms up after he grabs the rebound. Is that he's you you know what it is? He is so tall. Mitchell Robinson's so tall, seven foot. When when because when he's normally grabbing the Hooters, he has to go down instead of up. He's rare can find a woman seven foot tall to to grab. You know he has to grab down. So he's bringing, he's grabbing down. I, mean, I don't know. 
Maybe he has to go. Maybe he has to come to my tree over here and pick pick uh, mangoes or, or avocados. They're different. I need a I need a seven footer to grab him sometime. Hey, come and grab some. Maybe that's his off season training. Come. I mean, it's either that or like I don't know. He has to Jedi. He it looks like he's he's going to the Jets receivers coach and learning how to grab stuff. I mean, my goodness, yeah, they couldn't even, they couldn't even grab, they couldn't even grab a cold. All right, we got a timeout, fellas. We got a timeout. Then I'm going to timeout. We, we have a timeout. Yo, today, I can't believe it's already the 11th day of the freaking month. Last week, we were just, we were just doing April Fool's. Yes, he normally does. Yes, he does. NBA season ends this Sunday. This Sunday, final game of the regular season. Holy crap. It's, where did it, the regular season went? Whew. Wow. But you know what that means? It's springtime. 70 de- for you guys, hopefully 70 degree weather right away in the corner, 75. Yeah, it's starting to get to that point. I had to put yeah. up the coat already. Yeah, that's beautiful. But it's starting to rain more and more, so, you know. Well, April showers bring those beautiful May flowers. First time I see a, well, a Tapatio commercial. Look at that. Moving on up, Tapatio. Who puts the, who puts that on a pizza? I don't know. Weirdos. Yo, Trish Status is on a commercial for Blue Cheese? I never would have guessed it. All right, we're coming back from the commercial. Here we go. Here's Brunson now. Brunson back to heart, heart, top of the key. Take that dumb picture and picture off, please. Nobody wants to hear those two fools talk. Here's Hart, lost the ball. And I just heard half of yeah, I heard most of the YouTube say that. Here we go. <laughs> Turnover. Actually, no, it's the Knicks ball. Seven on the shot clock. Robinson gets the ball. Wants to get it back to Brunson. Brunson has a double team. Shot clock at four. Here's Hart. Hart with a nice move. Cutting to the basket. Drive, drive, drive. And out, driving my automobile as Hart gets to the basket. Here's Hutchison. Back over to Tatum. Tatum wants to get a screen. Got a mismatch. Thought about Mitchell Robinson. Got caught in the air. So it will be a three-shot foul. He got Mitchell Robinson. Something that he hasn't done much since, what, Tom Thibodeau's first year as a coach, getting caught, getting caught with those silly in-the-air fouls. Yeah. Dakota likes the Los Angeles Lakers. LeBron. All right. Thank you for sharing with us, Dakota. We appreciate that. As they're trying to get into the playing. I think they, they already hit, are playing bound. They're playing bound? There you go. Yeah. So we gotta w- win a game and hopefully win win a game, be the seventh seed, and you know and you probably take on uh Denver Nuggets and that altitude. The defending world champions, knock them out. Stun the world. Payton hits two free throws here. He has uh no, he had all three, 26-24. McBride. Miles McBride with the basketball here. McBride working here. Two minutes left here in the first quarter. McBride steps in for three. And that's no good. Rebound by Harford. He's good to Tatum. Now here's Hutchison. DiVincenzo swipes it away, but it'll be Boston's ball. Good defense there on Devo. He does very underrated defender, in my opinion. Absolutely. Tatum kicks it back to Hoffer. Back over to Tatum gets it with the screen. Now Snake Dribbling drives, kicks it out. Extra pass here. Hauser for three. Hauser misses the rebound right to the heart. Hart now over to Devo. Devo now driving. Devo going quick to the basket. What a feline quickness by the Wildcats. There you go as Hart gets an assist. And DiVincenzo running out there with some speed. Here's Hartford. Hartford 
Tries to go back door. Good defense by the Knicks as Brogdanovich comes up with that. Good defense. Just getting in the passing lane. That's smart. That's Br That's here's Bogdanovich. That's Thibodeau's favorite thing he's going to probably pull out on film. He'll probably sit, on, sit around with a box of tissues and get happy with that. As Bogdanovich gives it here to McBride. Now here's Hart driving to the basket. Hart up in the air. No, Mitchell Robinson gets the offensive rebound. But there he goes, putting the ball back down. But got it back out to McBride for three. Miles McBride, no good. Hart with another rebound. Hart off the glass is good. And he does, yeah, I drink my milk. Pose. The best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be. Yes, we will have Friday Night Smackdown tomorrow indeed. Are you uh, in your city, right, Detroit? Here we go, Tatum. Steps in for three. He got it. These guys are dangerous when it, um, Boston with Tatum, and they could hit the three anywhere. Here's Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich trying to go quick. Oh, Bogdanovich, quick, moving quick. Next, we're going for two for one, and they execute that perfect, perfect two for one situation for the Knicks. Now they're bringing the ball up here. Hutcherson, Tatum. Tatum trying to hold, trying to take up as much time. The Knicks will get it with around 10 seconds left in, before the quarter expires as Tatum is trying to wind it down. Shot clock at eight. Now Tatum steps in for another three. Tatum, no good. Fight for the rebound. Oh, Hutchison, you cannot do that if you're Miles McBride. All you had to do was stick your butt out and get in the way to get the offensive rebound here, 29-32. Only God would know that answer, Steven. Only God would know that answer, Steven. If we, of course, that's the question. <laughs> that, only God will know that one. <laughs> What's going on, Michael? In the building, saludo. Steven Chenzo. Brunson trying to go quickly. Brunson now. Brunson blocked by Tatum at the end of the first quarter. Next 32. Boston 29. What's up, everyone? Look at that. Let's hit the like button. Not bad. Not bad quarter here. Knicks defensively done some nice things here. They could, you know, like every like every quarter to quarter adjustments. They just got to continue with their adjustments. Absolutely. Yes, yes, yes. So tomorrow, don't forget tomorrow, we have the Knicks and Nets. Knicks and Nets. There you go. Don't speak on the dead. Let God judge them. That's why I said, I don't know. Only God knows. He knows the truth. That's why I like, you know, but rest in peace to him. That, you know, yeah. peace. And then. When we all stand in front of that tribunal, eternal life, we'll find out if uh, he'll then he'll know if he'll know then the truth. The book of life will open and see where he will stand. So that's all I gotta say on that. <laughs> Ooh. Playoff time! Playoff time! Playoff time! Do I got a let's see if I look at around the league for a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Nope. <laughs> the only crime OJ made it was to bank it at you. <laughs> And, and and you know he was he was you know that he killed it because uh he had to turn Kyle Jenner had to uh what you call it Bruce Jenner had to turn into uh Caitlin. I mean he couldn't handle that all that after he murdered that pussy. <laughs> Excuse the language, but I had to be come out with that joke. <laughs> 
It made it, it. It made him turn into a woman. He said, "I can't compete with the with the with the do with the with OJ with the juice. I can't compete with the juice." He straight up gave up. Yeah, man. He said, "I give up, man." Here, here. Take my testicles. I don't need them. Oh. Oh, what would you, Jeff? You had to you tease something. Do we have time? Yeah. News is Tom Brady's thinking about making the NFL comeback. I heard. I heard the. Uh, I heard the clip. I, I, uh, are you kidding me? <laughs> Meow. High mileage, and I and not and and not even a good. You didn't even put the good motor oil in that one. Yeah, no, no, no good motor oil. So we start off the second uh, quarter here, first half. As McBride has it, kicks it to Bogey, back to McBride. McBride working the dribble. Gets it back to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich, bended by Holiday, pulls up a three. Off the back iron. Pritchard with the rebound, bringing the ball up for the Celtics. Pritchard. Dribbling the ball around the three-point line. Gets it to Horford for three, and he hits it. High game. McBride over to Robinson. Robinson to DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo back to Deuce. Deuce driving. Snake dribbling. Kicks it out. Hart open for three. Got it. Richard driving. Gets the baseline layup. 35 to 34. Nick's up by one. As Hart fakes it. Kicks it out to Bogdanovich for three. Got it. Back-to-back -back threes for the Knicks here. Building a four-point lead, 38-34. to 34. Tatum driving. Draws the foul. Cried enough right. about it. Salute, Desmond. Did I say that out loud? Not to say that louder. He cried enough about it. Oh, he'll get teed up. Dude, he's been crying. Like, but they're at home. Misses the first one. Ball don't lie. Are you, yep. Makes the second one. Goes one of two. Three point game. McBride bringing the ball up. Then 20 left is McBride. Pivots, kicks it out to Hart. Hart over to DiVincenzo, takes the three. Off the mark, fighting for the rebound. Still Nick's ball. As it knocked out, of, it was knocked out of bounds. McBride inbounds it to Bogdanovich over to Robinson. Robinson looking, looking, dribbling. Gets it over to McBride. McBride being pressured. Deuce versus Deuce. He got the crossover floater. Ah, oh, couldn't get it. Robinson cleans it up. 40 to 35. Come on, Cookie Monster. Under 10 minutes here is Holiday. Spins, driving. Good defense by DiVincenzo. Holiday in the post, fall away jumper, got it. Nine thirty left here. It's DiVincenzo. Kicks it out to McBride. McBride to Bogdanovich. Over to Robinson. Robinson to Devo. Devo driving off the glass. Got it. 42 to 37. Pritchard with the ball. Pritchard driving. Richard defended by Robinson. Ah, oh, got the step. Missed the reverse. He blew it. Hart with the dribble, bringing it up the court. Hart driving. 
Crossover got the lay. 44 to 37. <laughs> Nine minutes left here in the first half. Art with six points and six rebounds. As Porzingis posts up, had the mismatch on Bogdanovich. European on European crime. Yep. McBride gets the screen driving. Ah. Couldn't get the pass off. Our, uh, our, our for it over to make ah, over to Tatum and Tatum gets the dunk. 820 here left in the first half. Cut to a three point game. And Knicks call a timeout. That could have been a foul though. Yeah, he looked, he grabbed, he bear hugged him. Yeah, he bear like, come on. What, what if I was doing, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have called the timeout just then. I would have drew the foul. And then you could call that timeout because the foul was called. Yep. Especially because it's Tatum. That's not, that's, we're not talking about that. Like, that's just basketball IQ awareness and, and just taking a gamble. The guy wrapped you up. I would try and make a basketball move to get out of it and say, hey, ref, what are we doing? Yeah. Um, 50 burger season. That's on the grill right now. The Knicks got to make it, got to cook that burger. The, the grill is there. The grill is warm. The patties yeah, are yeah, the patties yeah. are defrost. They just got to make it sizzle, baby. Make it sizzle. And then we had, I wanted a, a question uh, for Steven says, who hasn't had uh, Kardashian? Well, not this guy here. I can tell you this guy hasn't. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> oh. Man, too bad there's no endorsements there because after every uh, opportunity we heard, she was like, you know what? Here, take this with you. Take one of these with you when you finish. <laughs> Tib is yelling at McBride for no reason. You know what? I could go for a Corona right now. Even though I had, yeah, I, I even though I wasn't feeling well, but I could go for one Corona, nice cold Corona. Even though it's Thursday, I don't like to, I don't like to drink until Friday. I, I'm not upset at that thought process at all. A nice cold one, ready, just about the point of almost freezing. That's nice when you the, the it's frosted, nice and white. Or you could say dry, novia, like we say it in our in. in our culture, like, it's dressed like a bride in white. Ah, <laughs> I like that. Oh, yes, indeed. I would love that from Bridges. But I don't think Brooklyn wants Rondo. But, I mean, we have plenty of time to talk about that, though. I didn't like Sackabees. I tried it. No, I wasn't a big fan. Austin's first job was in Sackabees. I didn't. Mm. Hey, what's well, Johnny Davis? What's up? We, we acknowledged you earlier during the call, but I wanted to shout you out that now we have a timeout. Salute to you. My man, how are you? No, they're playing. Everyone's playing, but they're, they're not going to play many minutes, so they're not going to be. But Tatum is going at it like if he's, you know, he hasn't clinched. He hasn't clinched a number one seed yet or hasn't clinched anything. Like, they're still trying to avoid the playing, which is encouraging. Give me your best shot. From from the, uh, from an athletic standpoint, or you, or you, I don't want no flatulence. So we're returning back from timeout break. Knicks right now. Have a three-point lead. Bogdanovich steps back for three. Hits the back iron. Porzingis with the rebound. White with the ball. White over to Tatum. Tatum draws the foul. But he's yelling at everything. Every little thing he drives. He's saying, hey, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah, he's looking like he's getting a prostate exam every time he drives to the basket. Talk about clinching, right? Hey, hey. 
He was out there making a porn hub or something. Shit. Quick look around the league. Chicago's up on Detroit 64 to 55 at the half. As he hits the first free throw. Eight minutes left here as Brunson enters back into the game. Tatum goes two of two from the free throw line. Brunson bringing the ball up. Brunson working the crossover. Brunson gets the screen, pulls up midi. Got it. 46 to 43. We are all witness. 744 here left as Tatum has the ball. Tatum stolen by Mitchell Robinson. Brunson up ahead, and that should have been a kick ball. That should have been a kick ball. How are they not? They're looking at each other like idiots. Like, is it going to be a jump ball? <laughs> they want a jump ball. What do you? It's Nick's ball. Yeah, I was going to take those two thumbs and put them up where the sun don't shine. It bounced off of Tatum and Porzingis. Brunson mm -hmm. with the ball. Brunson over the heart. Hart gets the screen. Hart over to Hartenstein. Hartenstein back to Brunson. Brunson baseline brings Porzingis out. Gets it back from Hartenstein. Working the dribble. Oh my God! Put Porzingis on fucking skates, Jedi. Oh, oh my yes. God. Yes. Did you see him do that bachata and the merengue? Oh, Hartenstein. It's alive. They're showing a nice McBride package and a volleyball volleyball slap here is Brunson. Brunson. Ah, misses the first free throw. Brunson I said, was one of two. Yeah. Seven ten here left in the half is White as the ball. Good defense from Ananobi denying Tatum the ball. They get it to excuse me, Brown on a pin down. Pin uh Brown couldn't convert. Knicks fight for the rebound. Hart comes up with it. Hart running in transition. Layup blocked. But Knicks come up with it. Bogdanovich takes the side step three. Uh, hits the back iron, fighting for the rebound. And Porzingis saved it by knocking it off of Hart. Six forty left here. Is White driving? White gets the layup. Two point game. Forty seven to forty five. As Ananobi takes a three off the mark, Hartenstein keeps it alive. Hartenstein over to Brunson. Brunson, jab stepping, driving. Brunson pivoting, kicks it out. Hart fakes it. Now takes the three. No good. White with the rebound. White pushing the ball. White driving. White over to Brown. Brown pivoting. Brown off the glass. He just. Made it a more difficult shot for no reason. Hart with the ball. Hart over to Hartenstein. Hart takes the Hartenstein takes the floater. No good. Kept alive. Knicks pass it around. Brunson over to Ananobi. Ananobi takes the three. Got it. 50 to 45. Knicks back up by five. 545 here. Left in the half. White with the ball. White. Good defense. Takes the three. Now gets it to Brown. Brown, working in the post, fall away jumper, shot no good. Hartenstein over to Brunson. Brunson pushes ahead to Hart. Hart over to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich, reversal, got it. 52 to 45. T -t 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 timeout by Boston as the Knicks are running it up. They have a seven-point lead with 520 left in the half. 
And with most of the second unit, a mixture of some of the second unit, and they're moving so fast. Like they're moving quickly, the ball, they're they're trusting each other. That's showing you that shows you game 70, 70 something of the uh, I mean, no, 78, 80, no, what is it? No, 80. No, this is 80. This is 80. Tomorrow no. is 81 and 82. But 81, 81 is the Nets and 82 is for, is against the Bulls. Oh. So, so this, this is game 80. Yeah. So you're playing like game 80 with with the the Villanova Wildcats on the floor and now with a half a season with the trade with Bogdanovich, they're playing well. They're chilling. They're, they're, that's a good sign. What we're seeing, they're trusting, moving the ball around. Um, yes. But only thing, like uh, I mentioned, I think who mentioned it earlier? Oh, Magellan said, you know, wonder Brooks or Precious. I, that's another question I want to know. What did Precious do to be not getting playing time? I mean, they could use the rebounding and tenacity, even though they're it's a you know they're in the lead. But hopefully, you know, just let's keep an eye on that a little bit. Right now, there's no need to panic. Don't break what's not. Don't fix what's not broken. Which is, I understand that point. I think I can understand why he's not playing minutes right now. As hurt as we are, we don't need. Okay. You notice how Hart started taking shots? Yeah. Because he realized he can't not take shots anymore. We're in the crunch time. We're heading into playoffs. You have to start building a rhythm because guys are just not coming back anymore. You can't have both Hart and and, and, and uh, uh, Achua not looking for shots. I got you. I got you. Yeah, and Argo, you're right. Um, to go, whatever it's working. Uh, I get you. No, you guys are correct. I'm just... Maybe uh, get when, it, but right now they're not getting our rebound. They're not so right now. It's a, again, don't fix what's not broken. Mr. Sheldon, Daryl Johnson, Buenas noches, salute to you. Thank you for joining us. It's good to see you this evening here in our chat. Oh, what did, I, what did I saw earlier? Oh, Travis. Yes, I saw the news there, Travis. Indeed. Yes, I saw. I very. I was just talking what Travis was saying about the MJF uh, situation. He just, yeah. I mean, how many guys will be in a playoff rotation? I'm. Uh, somebody won't be. Lit. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. And of course, he mentioned yeah. about. I don't know what you're talking about. You mean uh where is it? Here we go. Yeah. He said, Do you think so, I'm coming back? Tatum <laughs> pulls up for three. And that's off the mark. It's Brunson driving now. Brunson working, stops, kicks it out to Achua. Achua over to Ananobi. Ananobi back to Brunson. Brunson gets a screen. Brunson fakes, kicks it out. Achua draws some contact, drives, shot no good. Holiday with the ball. Holiday gets it to Brown as Brown was fighting for position against Brunson. Foul by Brunson. And just as we spoke of him, was in the game. There you go. So, they missed the three. Brunt, uh, excuse me, Bogdanovich with the rebound. Bogdanovich over to Hartenstein. Hartenstein faking, looking, looking, looking. Gets it over to Achua. Achua over to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich working, driving, layup. Gets the roll. 54 to 45. Nine point lead for the Knicks. This is four minutes left in the half. Holiday with the ball. Holiday working a dribble. Holiday kicks it out. 
White passes it quickly to Horford. Horford to Tatum. Tatum drives in. Tatum kicks it out. And, yep, Brunson draws another charge. Yes. Brunson bringing the ball up. Three forty left as Brunson gets the screen over to Achua. Achua block. Still next ball. Seven to shoot. Dude, Horford is still yo. Horford is pulling him down. They inbound to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich pulls up a three. Got it. Good defense, better offense. 57 to 45. Knicks have a 12 point lead. White over the. I don't know who this is. And that's blocked by Hartenstein. Who's number four, Jedi? Can you look that's, that up? That's, hard. that's Holiday. That's Holiday? Mm -hmm. Look like a bigger body down there. As Brunson has the ball. Brunson driving, pulls up for three. Knicks are building a 15 point lead. Brunson completes the four-point play. Jedi, we have a 16-point lead. Knicks with a 14-0 run in the last 15 minutes of the game. They probably meant five minutes. And Ananobi gets called for a foul on White. White with the ball. White kicks it out. Porzingis for three. Way off. Holiday kicks it out to White. He uh, tries a three, and that's no good. Achua with the rebound over to Brunson. Brunson bringing the ball up with two and a half remaining. Brunson gets a screen from Achua. Brunson fakes it, fakes it, kicks it out to Achua. Achua back to Brunson. Brunson has Brown on him. Brunson gets a screen. Brunson pulls up for three. Got it. Jedi, I think we're all witness. 64 yes, to 45. Knicks Talk are building a 19-point lead. Holiday trying to dribble around. Holiday driving. Knock, uh, passes it over to Brown. Brown block on the three-pointer. Knicks are just working as Achua got that block. Brunson working a dribble. Brunson step back. Now gets it to Ananobi. Ananobi to Achua. Achua for three. And that's off the mark. Porzingis the rebound over to Tatum. Tatum pushes it to Brown. Brown driving. Brown, the, the defense. Porzingis for three. That's way off. He was just throwing it up there, Jedi. That was yeah. just. Yeah. Yeah. Brunson gets a screen. Brunson pulls up for three. And that's off the mark. But Achua keeps it alive to Ananobi. Ananobi over to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich open for three. And that rims in and out. Tatum running. And he draws the foul. Minute 19 here left in the first half. Knicks have a 19 point lead, 64 to 45. Tatum hits the first free throw. Knicks 
misses the second one. Ball don't lie. Hart with the rebound over to Brunson. Brunson bringing the ball up. 18-point lead for the Knicks. Brunson crossover driving. Brunson floater. Shot no good. Hartenstein couldn't tip it alive, and they say Celtics ball has been knocked out of bounds. Roughly a minute remaining as Tatum pushes it up to Brown. Brown driving, spinning, layup. Good defense blocked by Hartenstein. Hart with the ball. Pushes it to Ananobi. Ananobi driving. Throws it up. That should have been a foul. A lot of contact. Holiday running with the ball now. Holiday kicks it out to Brown. Brown driving. Brown to Porzingis. Porzingis blew it, and they call a foul. Oh, my God. What a bailout. Porzingis hits the first one. Two of two from the line. 40 seconds left. Hart bringing the ball up. Facing full court def uh, pressure as they knocked it out of his hand, but then he gets it back over the. Oh, nice pass. And Anobi for three. Got it. Ooh, he just God. left them way too much time. 67 to 48, back to a 19 point lead. 26 seconds left as White has the ball. White kicks it out, Brown for three, in and out. And and Anobi was held by Tatum, so loose ball foul on the rebound. Interesting to see. That looks like he was, if he would have not fouled him, he would have went free. He would have been um by himself on transition. Oh, yeah. That's, they should look at that for a fake foul. Yeah. That's why Ananobi ran like that. Because he secures that. He's off to the races. No, they're going to side out of bound it. Interesting. So Bogdanovich back in the game. Eight seconds left. Brunson with the ball. Five, four, three. Brunson hesitates. Got Porzingis on skates again. Pulled up. Got it. 69. 21 point lead for the Knicks. Ooh, you know, sorry guys. I, I, here we go. Let's get some. Let's get some some chats up in here. Let's go. Everybody's writing. <laughs> let's go. Twenty five to five run by this Nickabaka team. Next one hundred. It's in the building. What's up? Oh my God. Let's go. Man, are you seeing this? Big task. Are you seeing this? Big task. Wow. Talk to them, boys. Brunson, talk to them. Brunson having a new flavor of hot sauce out there. The him. Let's go. Man, let's go. Yo, this is a good 69 points, too. Before half, let's go. You're mighty aggressive with that sound. Good. Love that thing. Let's go. <laughs> so was Kim Kardashian's mom. Oh. We at the half. We at the half. Detroit is actually is trailing by 13 to the Bulls. That's the only game that's important to us. Um, everything is tomorrow. Orlando plays Philadelphia. Or Philadelphia, just like that, is one game out of the Magic. So that's not going to be playoff intensity in, in, brother, in the city of brotherly love and horse maneuver eating uh, people. 
Now who the Bucks? Oh, the Bucks. Who the Bucks got next? Hmm. I don't see the Bucks. No, the Bucks don't play. Oh, OKC. Oh, that's a tough matchup. OKC and the Bucks. Ooh, sec. We gotta win our game. Van, what's up, Van? Salute. You like Bogdanovich? I mean, Bogdanovich. I mean, that's purpose on this team for him. I, I don't see why not. His defense will be. I think on the coach Thibodeau knowing his assignment of um, Knicks 100, we're going to see that statement actually come to play in the postseason. I, I I have a funny feeling. You know, he goes, well, we haven't seen much from him. Um, but I think this postseason, as he's more acclimated with the Knicks now, and they're going to have some time off in between playoff to get more practices, I think Bradanovich is going to be up to speed to Knicks' standard of defense. It's not going to be the greatest, like, oh, my God. Um, you know, all NBA defensive team, but I think he's going to be really good. He's going to make some key stops um, for Bogdanovich going down. Um, here's the one thing I, I thought the Knicks needed to do was play the Celtics if they wanted to win um, like defense because they know they're going to score. But right now we're up by 20, so let's finish the story. Of, I am very encouraged by the Knicks here. This is the best they looked against the Celtics all season. Mr. Vernon be hacking. Salute with you. Salute. 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 Buenas noche. Look at look at your coach Tibber. Don't the scarecrow coaching up a nice game tonight, Vernon. Ooh, OKC will build the Bucks because they're playing for the top seed, unlike the Celtics. Let's hope you know we got We just gotta take care of our. Brooks on a house arrest. I mean, if he's at home, let me ask you this: If you were be able to stick at home house arrest, would you would you complain? Would you gripe? Hmm. Broggy can actually finish what the as he could. Yes, he could keep the whole team and Mitch. I mean, if if we could, if the cap, I think the cap will increase too. I'm talking about cashing back. Indeed, let's go. Pritchard near injured Mitch on the cross. I ugh, that prick Pritchard. Brandon is liking like he likes it here. Yeah, yeah. It, it's it, remember it's it takes time of adjustment. He's starting to get acclimated. Um, and Bogdanovich is gonna hit some shot. He also got height. Mitch is still playing catch up. He looks sluggish under the basket. Remember they hit they hit a little bit of a wall. Maybe 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 Mitchell Robinson hits a little bit of a wall. We'll see. Brooks is going to show up. Family, just wait. There you go. There you go. Love the power of positivity. Brogdon is causing um, height is causing problems for teams, Johnny. Yeah. Thoughts on Dante. Dante DiVincenzo, what a pickup for the Knicks SG Sports Talk. Um, Dante DiVincenzo for the amount of money that he signed for the Knicks. The... Shooting that he's given the Knicks over 40% from three-point land. Um, you could even say most improved player of the year. Just think if he would have hit the open market now, where he would be right now. He'd probably get the Emmanuel quickly looking type of money. Or the Brunson deal, uh, 103, 104, four years for, from a team that won't, that could use him. I mean, teams are overpaying. So we're lucky that we signed him for we did for the amount of years that he did. So good job there. Portland and Golden State. Yeah, that's going to be Golden State. I don't think Portland has enough horses to beat Golden State. That I mean, I don't see it there yet. I mean, it's, when you have those three there um, for Golden State, even though they're playing in, playing in bound and all that, but damn, that's a, I, 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 there. I mean, if I have a team to need a couple games, one game to to keep alive, I will take Golden State. Man, they're they're just that dangerous. I don't know if that's going to happen, Van, but we shall see. We shall see if Bridges for, for Randall. I saw the Slam magazine. I was going to use it um, as, a, as a thumbnail, um, and I might still do it for the final game. We'll see if folks postseason. Portland didn't even have McCullen or Lillard. 
Yeah, they play better. Sometimes when you think you're taking a step back, you actually take a step forward because you get players who are more hungrier. And it, you can start building and see who you build and who you don't build for Portland. Trust me, we've been through that that stuff that you've been in Portland. If you're a Portland fan. Um, ugh. Hope Toppin. Hope Toppin gets it together. Uh, which Toppin, though? <laughs> I know which one you're talking about, Dixon. I know what you're talking about. Only in your dreams. They're not trading. It's not going to happen. I mean... Michael, unless if there's a third team involved where they send, uh, and, but I, I, like you said, I, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing that so far fetched um, to give Bridges what he wants, and and the Knicks organization what they want Bridges. I don't know. I don't think so. I think both. You know, you have a better chance of WWE working with All Elite Wrestling on a Super Show than Brooklyn trading with New York. I mean, I could be wrong. For those players. Who's all elite? I mean, yeah, all empty wrestling. Excuse me. Let me correct myself. Dame Time is one of the catchiest nicknames for Dame. Yeah, it is. They also had Fat Joe on their podcast. And Fat Joe sounded like an uncle in the interview. <laughs> Go crack. Cut. You add Cat instead of Randall. This team could be deadly. Hmm. A lot of questions. Let's see how first let's see how far. Let me find out. Let me see. You add cat instead of Randall. This team will be deadly. Here we go. I like when you announce the same time, baby. It's about to do. <laughs> I mean, you're a big Damian Lillard fan. He's gonna have to. He's gonna have to put that team on his back here. We're no under the kumpo with that calf injury. Now, I don't want to wish that, but when there's that calf injury, we saw that with Kevin Durant, and then and we know what it led to. You saw the same thing with Aaron Rodgers. What it led to. Um, ugh, don't just keep do it. I didn't say I'm saying keep an, just keep an eye on that. That's no, that's a delicate. No, no, all, all serious. That's a very delicate situation. They take your time with onto the Kumpo because when they get beat, we want to make sure he's healthy. We don't want we don't want to hear not just the, when he they get beat by an NBA team. We want to make sure they're all healthy. I don't want to hear excuses from the from the Bucks Nation of why they Kevin, lost. If I'm Kevin, if I'm Bucks Nation, I'm sorry to tell you, like. This year is not a year like I'm like after the half. Excuse me, after the All Star break, I'm not looking forward to the playoffs. I'll Your be worried. Right was was you know you had multiple chances to get right after some of these losses with Doc at the helm. It's like, but what are we even like? No, I just want this year over with. I hear you. The Celtics will will get chopped by the Knicks. Hopefully, we we we're, we're up we're up big here, but we just gotta finish finish the story out there. Finish the story, Knicks. We gotta get Stokes one game at a time, and and let's get this one to continue fighting. Absolutely, you know how it goes: one possession, one quarter, one half, one game at a time. The Knicks gotta continue to win those small battles, and they've been doing it, doing it well. They represent New York, but they're straight out of the garden. There you go. Dame lost his fame. In a traditional big man role, Tibbs unleash, you think we might try to draft the big man from Iowa? It all depends. I mean, we're not going to get a good draft. I mean, we got a couple, but the way the Knicks finish the season off, if he's available... I mean, it's up to the front office what they need and what they where they want to save money. Jonas is out there, um, three races in the game. Yeah, calf injury. Yeah, yeah, right after the playoffs. How many points do you think Curry would drop tonight versus Portland? Over and under, I'll say 24 and a half points if I'm betting there for Curry. 24 and a half points. You want to take the over? 
I'll take the over if you're giving me that. I think it dropped like 28 bucks. Window is closing. Um, teams typically get a five to seven year run of being elite. Absolutely. And especially in a salary cap league, the Knicks 100. Yeah, absolutely. You're going to think he's going to drop 60. Wow. You come back tomorrow. If you drop 60, we're gonna, we will put you over with a lot of flowers and accolades. We will give you a standing ovation clap if that's because, wow, that's a nice. I like when they do predictions. Um, wow. That's a good one. Let's see. Yeah. I see the Knicks have a lot of energy, and they're ready for the playoffs, man. I'm ready. Well, we all stoked, Darnell. We cannot wait two weeks from now when they, when we get that first game on our first opponent. Oh, man, we'll be excited. The Garden will be rocking. In the playoffs after the and he has the Achilles injuries. I mean, injuries overcompensating is why I don't was experiencing. He's no only no go hard, and he has never um, cruises. Yeah, he plays hard all game. He, that's what you got to respect that from him. You have oh. to respect that. Like that's I'm not gonna lie. That's the same problem we kind of have with Julius Randle. Yeah. I mean, he doesn't play hard on defense all the time, but he plays hard. Uh, Billy Brunson is the leading scorer with 14 points. If I'm not mistaken, Curry's gonna drop seven. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> Giannis pulling at LeBron. Precious played. He played. He had a couple of nice. He had some nice impact for the minute minutes he played on the court. Johnny. He had some good some good blocks and he was leading some fast breaks. Um, Precious played okay. He was he had a, a couple of open looks. He missed on an open look three, but that's not Precious' game, you know. Especially when the, then the Knicks were up by sixteen, I believe, when he took that three when he missed it. But it was a nice open look. If it goes in, now you're up by nineteen. You're you're, you know, you 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 gambled on the hand and got a little you know got a little bit got a little bit cocky. She's gonna she's gonna change she's gonna bring eyeballs to the WNBA. But here's the thing that sucks. She's gonna be stuck in Indiana. That's the only thing that sucks. I mean, no disrespect yeah. to no disrespect to Indiana. And, and and I don't wanna say like here you go, the East Coast guys want them to be on, on those markets. No, it's the eyeballs test. Um I think if she goes to the an East Coast team like the Liberty uh, or even Mercury, uh um not Mercury, the Suns. Connecticut Suns, yeah. yeah, and um, or even the Mystics, you get to see. Although they did, the Mystics did get um that number one draft pick. I forgot their name. They didn't really move the needle, but viewer wise. But you want it in a, in a market where you could just put her on billboards across the cities, you know, like. But she's not Dude, going that's there. What helps, that's what helps Sabrina Ionescu get her first yeah. shoe. Yes, Sabrina Ionescu. She gets, you know, and 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 I and I think that's gonna. I hope that helps the WNBA gets at least more exposure. Now, you know, I think I think uh, yeah, yeah. I think it's gonna be interesting to see Kate, Kate and, and where she ends up. I mean, she put Iowa. A small, not a small school, not a small school. Let's let me take that back. Iowa is very known when they play college football, but when it comes to women's basketball, you don't think of Iowa basketball and the way she yeah. she put that that program on for for female sports. Yeah, um, that helps. Yeah, Kirby will have a triple double tonight: sixty point ten rebounds, ten assists. Damn, you really are a big fan. I, you must got him on fantasy. <laughs> You, you know, Tibbs is ripping into everyone about Boston going to punch back and grab. Yes, he's going to keep them sharp. He's got to keep the team. He's got to keep the team sharp, organized, hammering him at home. This is a this is a league of runs, and Boston is going to put on a run. Yeah, she will shine um, better player than her. Yeah, she just she just levels above. Right now, uh, Kyle in the collegiate game. We'll see how that translates in the WNBA, which I don't think it will translate too much. A lot of people said that about Sabrina, though. Hmm. I, I don't think it's. I don't think it's that it won't translate. I just don't think she'll instantly be dominant her first year. That's fine. Here we go. As it will be Brunson bringing the ball up. 
DiVincenzo back to Hart, top of the key, back to Brunson. Brunson wants to, guarded by Brown. Brunson keeping the dribble. Now driving. Driving. Just bounce pass to Hart. Hart thought about the three. Has space. He's not going to take the three. And he has, misses the first shot. Tatum with the rebound. Porzingis was respecting and letting him shoot the three. Here is White. Holiday now on the curl. Back to Tatum. Tatum rises for three. And Tatum misses it. Loose ball right to the hands of Porzingis. Extra possession. White steps in for the three. No good. Rebound by Porzingis. Huh? 69-48. Oh. Here's Brunson. Back to the back. Behind the back to Hart. Now OG Ananobi. Ananobi around the curl. Ananobi stops. Turn around. Turn around jumper. No, he was trying to give in that to Harkenstein. Harkenstein now. Hart for three. Off the mark. Right to the hands of Holiday. Here is Holiday. Now wants to give this to Brown. Here's the double team to Holiday. She brings it extra to Porzingis. He's going to shoot the three. Porzingis hits it from downtown over the stretch. Hand of Ragu. That's just Porzingis using his height. 69-51. 90 seconds gone by here. Brunson with the screen. Brunson now. Gives it to Harkenstein. Bounce pass to DiVincenzo. Devo, turn around. Floater. In and out. Good. Dante DiVincenzo. Putting that extra sauce on that hook. 20-point lead for the Knicks. Holiday now. Holiday with the curl. Holiday with the basketball. Gets the screen. Bounce pass to White. Extra corner for Brown. Rises. And he cannot deliver for you. Here comes the Knicks. Here is Brunson. Jab stepping. Sidestep for three. It's gone. Three-pointer. Jalen Brunson. 74-51. Knicks trying to punch people in the mouth here to start. Here's Holiday. Bounce pass here to Porzingis. Porzingis holds the basketball. Porzingis going to turn around and shoot. Porzingis bricks it. Rebound by Adenobi. He'll give it to Brunson. Here is Brunson. You see what's going on, big pass. Brunson shaking. And now he's going to shoot. It's gone. Three-pointer. Jalen Brunson with the depth switch. 77-51. Here's Mighty Mouse. Save the day. Here's Brown. Double team. Brown gives it to Porzingis. Porzingis wants to give it back to Brown. Brown gets it. Driving on. Brunson tries to draw the foul. And there is a foul call. It'll probably be on Harkenstein. Because Brunson was stationed there trying to draw a charge. Ah, this is my beauty. That's my point guard right there, man. Brown shooting a free throw here. And he hits the first one. He hits both free throws here, extends the lead. The Knicks uh, deficit is 77, actually lead, 77-53, my goodness. Brunson now. Brunson looking for a double team. Bounce pass to Arkenstein. Trying an OB. Oh, beautiful ball movement and cutting to the basket. Cutting like a Ginzu knife was on an OB to the basket for the dunk. Give Arkenstein an assist now. Now White now. White being harassed by DiVincenzo. Gets a pass to Tatum. Almost stolen. Back to Porzingis. Porzingis, oh, man, had positioning there on Harkenstein. 79-55. Miss need to move the, continue to move the basketball here. Here's Jalen now with the high screen. Now he takes it himself. Go full speed. Floater. Oh, it's good. Jalen Brunson with the burst of speed. 81-55. Here is, oh, Holiday stepping for three. So we're above eight-minute mark here. 81-58. 81-58. Brunson now, who's catching a little fire here in the third quarter, being consistent. Here's DiVincenzo. Almost turned the ball over backcourt, but he gets it. Here's Devo driving. Euro lost the ball. Harkenstein fight for the loose ball. Harkenstein gets it. Shot clock winding down. Harkenstein being corralled. 
and mugged, and it will be a shot clock violation. So here's Boston with the basketball here. 740 mark. 81-58. This is a big possession. Knicks needs to play some defense here. Can't let Boston get on this. Can't let them get a bucket here because then they'll try to seize momentum. Here's Holiday on the curl. Holiday driving. Holiday kicks it back out. Tatum wide open for three, and that's no good. That was a big miss by Boston. Here's DiVincenzo. He'll give it to Brunson. Back to Devo. Devo now driving. Devo. Oh, try to posterize, but misses the dunk. It would have been a beautiful move. Holiday trying to alley-oop, and they can't. What a sloppiness. It looked like the Bulls the other night. Here's Brunson. Sometimes keep it simple, stupid. 81-58. Devo to Ananobi. Ananobi, Hart. Back to Ananobi. Ananobi thought about it. He's got Porzingis on him. Working on him now. Driving. Going quick off the glass. No good. Holiday with the rebound. Here's Brown. Brown in transition. Brown, Euro. And that's going to call a bumping foul. A blocking foul. Brunson still on his back. They're going to challenge the call, Chef. Yeah, I would challenge it. I think Brunson got there in time. All right, so there's a challenge on the court. We'll see. Damn, and Diva would have came down with that dunk, Chef. Woo! I think we would have popped. Yeah. Because it was a beautiful thing. He was up. He, well, he got up. He was trying, he was trying he to throw that. With, he was trying he to throw it down with some with some thunder bro he was looking like Thor out there bringing the hammer down Devo gets up man he got hops he got buddies for real for real like I'm not even gonna lie I like as to how the Warriors let him outside of the building I don't know maybe because they couldn't afford him they couldn't afford man, him they, they're over they're over that they're, they're in that luxury tax they're in that tax bracket with the where it's a lot of money if they if they're already in penalty situation their tax bill was very high but man i'm so thankful that the knicks got divincenzo that was the sharpshooter they needed yep there were a lot of people on twitter who poo pooed that get i'm like man i remember the day i saw that i'm like yeah hey, you know what if that's all we got, I'm fine with that. Steven Chenzo, I said it from the beginning, Jedi. Watch when he acclimates himself. Because he was one of those players that constantly annoyed us as a buck. Yeah. And then when he was on the when he was on the uh, Warriors, I was like, that's one of our, that that's the worst nightmare I could ever have. Even if we play him twice a year. It's just annoying and I don't want to deal with it. I think I think the Knicks win that challenge because Brunson has a reputation of drawing those fouls and knowing how to get good positioning and being stationary. I think I think when they look at the replay and they give him, he's got to have at least three seconds, in my opinion, for it to be valid. And I think he has the three seconds that he needs to overturn that call. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, I mean, it is in Boston, but I think the Knicks win this challenge. Quick look around the league. Chicago is up on the Detroit Pistons, 110 to 86. Yeah, that's it. That and us. And the Knicks are beating the Celtics right now, 81 to 58. You have a 24 point lead. There's a no, 23, excuse me, 23 point lead. I'll tell you what, they're taking an awfully long time here to get back. Oh, here we go. So all of a sudden, the Knicks got the ball. So I think they won the challenge because they got the ball. Great. Brunson misses. Great coverage, TNT. Shh. 
Yeah, so apparently they won the challenge. Okay. Terrible. Yeah, Brunson is okay. He came back clutching his wrist, but he's okay. He's still he's in the game. Brunson has the basketball in his hands. 81-60, 21-point lead here. Here's Brunson working. Brunson, here's a triple team. Kicks it to DiVincenzo. Catch and shoot three for DiVincenzo. And that was one of the bad, ugliest looking shot for DiVincenzo. You could give him a mulligan there because he was moving away in motion. Yeah. Yeah, he was set before contact. So, yeah, well, something that I told you, it was a reputation. All right, here's Brown. Tatum now kicks it back to Brown. Brown lost the ball. Now, DiVincenzo all alone. One man to beat Porzingis stops. Kicks it back out. Brunson transition three. Oh, it's good. Three pointer. Jalen Brunson. Michael Caputo, what's up? Here's White. White now. White. Got carded by Mitchell Robinson. Robinson now to Porzingis. Porzingis holds the ball up. Porzingis and rims out. Good defense there by DiVincenzo hanging on him like a cheap suit. Here we go. Here's Hart. Hart. Mitchell Robinson. We'll hand it off to Devo. Devo got fouled. Overzealous there by White. And he threw, he threw the three-point kiss up, too. He did this. And he threw the kiss up. Oh, Brunson's just him, man. Brunson will be the inbounder. He'll give it to Mitchell Robinson. Robinson right back to Brunson. Five-minute mark here in the third quarter. Here's Brunson now. Jalen working on Porzingis. Now, step, change direction on an Obi. On an Obi, block. Oh, man, blocked by Porzingis. Boston comes up with the loose ball. Here's White. White kicks it out. Tatum open for three. And he no good. Rebound. Fight for the rebound. Porzingis just kept it alive. Block by Ananobi. Get that crap out of here. Here's, Por here's Tatum. Tatum driving. Tatum going strong. And he got it. He split two defenders there. He had good two of the Knicks. One of the two best Knicks defenders on Ananobi and Mitchell Robinson there. He still got, got the layup somewhere, somehow through the window. Here's Brunson. Here's Brunson now backing in. Mitchell looks old. Everyone talks about Brunson. Looks like the Kraken. We get Medusa's head, though. Look at a little clash of the Titans here. Here's a spin. Brown misses. He blew it. You blew it. Here's Brunson. Back to Hart. Hart now. Euro. Blocked by Porzingis, but Hart gets the rebound back. And Porzingis commits a stupid foul by tripping him. Under four minutes, 84-62. Knicks up. They will be inbounding the basketball here as they want to show the girl in Boston checking her phone out instead of watching the game. At least she's not digging for gold, right? That's true. Here's she's probably looking for tender. Now here's uh -huh. here's Mitchell Robinson in the heart, and we get a whistle and a turnover. What is up with Thibodeau's hair? Whatever's left of it. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> that man committed himself to the grind a long time ago. He. <laughs> He didn't stop caring about his appearance. <laughs> time out, time out, time out. Yes, indeed. Time out. Tip of those hair, I mean. <laughs> oh, not a turnover? It was a timeout? Okay. Okay, good. Thank you for correcting me on that one. It was a timeout instead of the turnover. <laughs> he looks like he does look like a Teletubby. You know what? That's a good one. Coach Teletubby. I mean, but Jedi, you think this is more so his game plan tonight or Sims? Good question. 
I mean, maybe, you know, you know how the season winds down. They are sometimes let the intern be an interim coach. Maybe it is yep. Coach 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 Sims out there. <laughs> oh my God! Even T I think even Thibodeau has a good has a laugh from time to time on that. What do you think? Is it your game plan or, or Sims? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> All right, we got a timeout here. Mitchell's looking like he's learning how to walk for the first time. That's how he always looks. But just having him on the floor, it's for the love it. Married guys can't let it go like that. I, no, Desmond. I don't think Thibodeau's married, Desmond. Thibodeau's, Thibodeau's a ham. He's married to the game of basketball. Seriously. I think he doesn't have I don't think he has children or, or, or a spouse. Lintern made the lineup. There you go. I don't think. I don't. Yeah, I think. Yeah, he's a bachelor. He's the most eligible bachelor in, in upper on the Upper East Side. And, and he, yeah, he, I believe he's. Uh, I think he bought a, a, a Derek Jeter's old apartment. Only thing is, when they leave, he gives them he gives them a, a, an NBA. Uh, he gives them a Knicks merchandise instead of a a purse like Jerry Jeter. All right, we got a long. These commercials are long, but get used to it. Mitchell is our anchor, and he's the de he's the defender. Um, he mit and Mitchell is center. A purse, but he probably gives him a Nick purse. Yeah, one of those Don when Dante and Burks, Donnie and Burks Nick's purse. On your way back with a gift bag, there's a foul. Arms Beach is head cut for men is in New York. I mean, they don't they don't reach out to him. Maybe he doesn't want to. He becomes more of a he, then he becomes a hunk, and then he can't. Women don't let him concentrate on his basketball. Brunson and Hart, and now I was a turnover. Here's aggressive Brown with the dunk. So a little mis mishap here. Twenty point lead. <laughs> Here's Brunson. Brunson now. Brunson driving. Brunson again. Bump. Put up the shot. And he gets it. That should have been a three-point play opportunity. 86-64. Brunson continues to cook. Here's White. Tatum. Tatum now. Tatum turn around. And he got fouled. Counted and won. So Tatum going to the line to the complete three-point play. Tatum trying to complete the three-point play here. 309 mark here in the third quarter. 86. And we're waiting for this free throw to see if he hits it. 86-67 as he does. All right. Brunson will bring the basketball up. McBride is in the game. Get over the timeline. Let's go. Here's Brunson. Brunson working. Brunson getting in front with the floater, and he continues to dissect Boston, getting what he wants in the paint, driving forward. Here's Brown. Brown. Kick and almost stolen. Back over to Holiday. Holiday now. Holiday driving. Holiday kicks it out to Tatum. Tatum rises for three, and that's no good. Rebound by Hart. As both guys collide there, but good job there for Hart keeping his dribble alive. Brown had the ball stolen, knocked away, and Thibodeau arguing that he was hooked. I 
Oh, I got that on the intro with the Jabba laughing. I got I got Jabba's laugh. I could get that. I could get that. I could work on that. And there's a silly foul by Boston. They had the Knicks trapped there because they had to get the ball past the timeline because the eight seconds was almost up. They couldn't inbound it in the backcourt. It would have been a violation. They got it, and the, and the Celtics got a little overzealous and committed a silly foul. As the Knicks would inbound the Earth. And we get a timeout as the Knicks had a hard time inbounding the ball. Now, this is something that they cannot get sloppy with because especially in the postseason that's going to be very very crucial the inbound play they got to make sure those inbound plays are nice and crisp and clean tom Thibodeau will call a timeout all right we got a timeout We got him shook. You got to stay tight. Yes. Continue. All right, we're coming back here. DiVincenzo, the inbounder, looking to get someone the ball. Bounce pass to Mitchell Robinson. Robinson looking to hand off to Brunson. Brunson on the right side of the curl. Brunson now driving. Brunson steps back for three. It's in and out. Mitchell Robinson with the dunk. Count it and one. So the cookie monster in the right place at the right time with the putback dunk has a chance for a three-point play opportunity. Mitchell Robinson completes the three-point play. Let's go. 91-67. Two minutes. Holiday. Tatum. Tatum now back to the basket. Now goes baseline. Tries to reverse layup. No good. Rebound by Hart. Good defense by Mitchell Robinson. Altering in that shot. Here's Hart. Hart now. Brunson. Brunson steps in for three. That's good. Three-pointer. Jalen Brunson. 36 points and counting for Jalen Brunson. Here's Brown. Brown discombobulated Hartford for three. Hartford, no good. Rebound by DiVincenzo. 36 points for Jalen Brunson and counting. Here's Brunson again looking for more. Brunson working with the ball. Brunson jab stepping. Brunson spins. Brunson back. Kicks it to the back. Give and go. Brunson off the glass. Oh, it's good. Jalen Brunson. Oh, sucky, sucky. Quack, quack. Here we go. Misses by the Celtics. Here comes DiVincenzo. That was Holiday on the miss. Next with the possession there. Now Devo now. Mitchell Robinson lost the ball. Butter in his popcorn. Here's Tatum who got away with a carry. Here's Brown. Brown layup is good. 96-69. One minute. Here's Hart. Hart now. Hart. Driving. Layup. Count it. And one. Josh, the hitman. Hart. To the line. Completing a three-point play. Let's go. Looking to hit the 99 point before the fourth quarter. Beautiful.
And he completes the three-point play to rattle it in. And one. Let's go. 99-69. Let's go. Yes. Look. Yes. Let's get it on. Let's start this one. Let's go. We got to start this one there. Chef, we got to start this one. Hold on. I got to put this there. I got to show this one. There we go. That's for you, Chef. That's the kick out. Hilu. Pritchard. Hauser. Hauser. Step for three. Hauser kicks out. And, and Hart comes up with the rebound. Hart. Keeps the ball. Hart now passes it to Brunson. Look at that. And there's a foul. What the hell? He's got to get mauled before you could call a foul on Springer. I need that Hart Foundation shirt. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Yeah. To make a, a Hart Foundation shirt like that with Brunt with uh, Hart and Harkenstein back to back like this. Oh, that'd be cool. Idea. The light. <laughs> light bulb. I'm so electrifying that I, that, you know, I just had an idea. What's up, Jacob? Our two debuts tomorrow, and also Motor City Machine Guns in Detroit. Richie, you know what? I didn't think about that. Good one there. Good one with the Motor Cities in Michigan, and they're in Detroit. Brunson, ah, misses the first free throw. Willie, Sorry. what's up? What's up, Richie? How you doing? We got Willie dot go New York go. What's up, Willie? Willie Willie. Brunson goes one or two to nine. One hundred and sixty-nine or eighteen point nine seconds. Let's go, Knicks. Shot clock is off. Final shot of the of the quarter here. Pritchard, Pritchard now, Pritchard now driving, Pritchard shoots, Pritchard the prick hits it, 171, McBride, Miles McBride now at the buzzer, almost, we got it, 100 and 171 as we hit to the third quarter, you know what it is, it's fourth quarter time, fourth quarter time, fourth quarter, Quasimodo ring the bell. <laughs> Fourth quarter. Let's finish our story tonight. Let's go. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh. It's pissed me off when you say stuff like that. There you go. You want to get away? So Chicago beat Detroit 127 to 105. DeRozan with 39 points. Vucevic with 27 and 11. Ewan McBride is having a man equipping moment, scoreless after seven shots. I mean, McBride hasn't had a lot of run on the court either because Brunson is just cooking. He's just cooking right now. Like, he's yeah. not in rhythm. The other thing, too, is like, Kev, you don't. This is a team where if we already have him on the ropes, the one thing you don't want to give him is a lineup of Brunson and McBride because then you're, and they're, they're, at some point, going to put Tatum or Brown at the two, and one of them is going to have to guard either one of them, and that's a tough assignment. Like, it's mm. 
I'm like, it's just one of these things that tonight Brunson's got it going. We thought that, you know, Achua couldn't help out. Achua came in, played some serviceable minutes. McBride doesn't have to, you know, hit a bunch of shots to be good tonight. Like, Josh Hart has been showing us all season. You don't have to hit a bunch of shots to be serviceable. And with the, what, 29-point lead? I don't think I don't think scoring is what we you know need to kind of close out the game. Hey. Oh, so the Knicks Buckets don't have the mm. And they get it to Pritchard. Pritchard over to Hauser. Hauser to... Is that semi Ojale Over to Hauser. And he hits mid-range. Oh. He emptied the bench. Hey. All right, McBride with the ball. Over to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich driving. Kicks it out to Achua. Achua driving. Gets a dunk. All right, precious. 102 to 73. Richard with the ball. Richard gets a screen. Richard kicks it out. The I don't know who that is. Back to Pritchard. Pritchard driving. Layup no good. Even Chenzo the rebound. Over to McBride. McBride working the dribble. Lost it, gets it right back. Over to Hartenstein. Hartenstein to Agent 44, he whips it into, ah, turnover. So Brunson an exit with 39 points. Go to a locker room, though. Yeah. Pritchard pulls up, puts up a three off the mark. Next ball. Nick's passing it around. Oh, McBride cutting gets it down. Nice. 104 to 73. Hauser with the ball driving. What's up? Mid range, no good. Hartenstein the rebound. Hartenstein's ah, Vincenzo couldn't contain the pass. One hundred four seventy three with nine and a half remaining here. As Pritchard pulls up the mid range shot, no good. A two with a rebound. Chua over to McBride. McBride to Hartenstein. Hartenstein over to uh, Vincenzo. Three off the mark. Out at a rebound. Out there kicks out to number 50. Another white boy in Celtic Green. And he hits a three. Hartenstein driving. Hartenstein gets the layup. 106 to 76. Hauser hits a three. Back to a 27 point lead for the Knicks. McBride cutting. 
can't save it up. Knicks are trying too much here. Eight oh five left here. Miss Pritchard kicks it out. Springer misses the three, but Hauser takes a deep one off the offensive rebound and hits it. One oh six to eighty two. Tibbs looks upset. Bogdanovich. Gets it to McBride. McBride spinning, driving. McBride kicks it. Arnstein floater gets the uh, gets the floater. 108 to 82. Pritchard driving. Richard kicks it out to Hauser. Good defense. Back to Pritchard. Richard driving. Richard bumps, takes the mid range. Shot no good. Hartenstein the rebound. Seven minutes left here in the fourth. Is McBride's pushing? McBride back to Hartenstein. Hartenstein looking, fumbles it. Hauser running. Hauser driving, kicks it out. Timeout by Tom Thibodeau. 108 to 84. Yeah, they got to just continue to. They could actually play trading buckets, but still, you want to turn them, make their dip shots a little more difficult. Keeping them focused. I like it. Tib is like, nope. <laughs> you cannot say that man takes a takes a playoff. He cares. Even if yeah. like him or don't like him. That man cares. Look at the OKC guys with a commercial. Mm. It's not a good commercial, but it's good to see them on a commercial. Yeah, you know, everyone, you know. I mean, but that's that's the time you also find out who translate. That's true. This group is a minus six. Yeah, they got to clean that up. But, of course, could be a little bit. When you're up, but so big, though, you tend to do things that you're not really supposed to. Um, They haven't mentioned if he's back on the bench, Johnny Davis. We don't know. Uh, maybe let's see if this after this timeout. You know what? You're intrigued my my um curiosity as well. I'm going to see if he returns back. I mean, there's no need for him to return back. He could stay back and get treatment, but, you know, just for us, for our psyche, we'd like to see him back. Yeah, maybe checking his left wrist. Yeah, that's what they're exactly what they're doing. Yeah, especially if we're up that big, Brunt, uh, with, um, have Brunson, yeah, on the bench, yes.
Come back from commercial. Bogdanovich. Ball almost tipped and turned over. Deuce pokes up the three. Shot no good. 620 remaining. I don't know who this guy is. Turnover. Brunson's back on the bench. Good, good. Just for our sake, just for our psyche. McBride oh, uh, gets it back from Machua. Gets a screen over to Hartenstein. He kicks it to DiVincenzo for three, and that's good. There we go. Wow, let's go. Hello, Mary. Hello, Mary. Hauser gets his own put back after a miss. 111 to 86. 530 here left. Excuse me, under 530. Nick's are passing it around. And ooh, Hardenstein gets a put back himself. 113 to 86. Celtics answer right. Gesundheit. Celtics answer right back with the three. 113 to 89. This is under five minutes remaining. And DiVincenzo reminds them who the big ragu is. 116 to one to 89. Knicks almost come up with a steal. But Pritchard hits a three. 116 to 92. McBride with the ball. Under 415 remaining as Hartenstein's looking. Gets it to DiVincenzo. Back to Hartenstein. Loader, no good. Richard driving, keeping the dribble alive. And ooh. Under four minutes. Sachua has the ball. Over to Hartenstein. Hartenstein to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich kicks it out to Achua. She was spinning. Chua pivoting, layup shot no good. He gets his own rebound. Chua, and that's a turnover. It's Pritchard kicks it out. White boy misses the three. Pritchard, white boy hits a three. That's out the window. Yeah, that's out the window. Three minutes, under three minutes remaining. Hartenstein has the ball. Yeah, Over yes. there, DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo bump, takes the three. Rims in and out and in and out. Pritchard, is there passing it around? White boy hits another three. I don't know who this guy is. Mahai, Who's number 50? Ma, Mahai Luke. Mahai Luke. Mahai Luke. Who that? Under what? Two minutes remaining here, Jedi. You, you can take off the ticker. It's a close game. Yeah, yeah, Coach Thibodeau is sweating like it is. Under two minutes, Pritchard has the ball, 16-point lead for the Knicks. He fakes the three, now drives, kicks it. Cornette blew it! 
Oh my God. And Pat Stolen. DiVincenzo. Oh my God. Double team, pivots, kicks it to Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich, facing a double team, kicks it to DiVincenzo, driving, kicks it to Hartenstein. He throws up the floater. Shot no good. That's um Sky. That's yeah. That's SVI. Yeah, I didn't know that. Oh, that's V. That is that is V. Makai Luke. Yeah, I'm like Makai Luke. I've heard that name before. Makai Luke. That's yeah. That's oh, we got a timeout. Cool Was he with bro. us this year or last year? No, no, last year. Last year. He got he got released when the heart trade happened. Yeah. All right, look like they're going to cruise to a victory. That's a funny commercial. Well, tonight... Before we get going, let me let me see something right here. The Knicks, the Knicks are doing what Chef does every day, cooking. They're cooking the Celtics. Look at that. Look at Chef Brunson. Look at that. A picture that you would appreciate, Chef. There you I go. Do. Look at that. Look at that. Indeed. Indeed. We got Austin. What's up? Busy spring for the MSG, both the Rangers and Knicks. It's the summer of 94, baby. Hopefully we can finish the story. We got unfinished story. We can finish the Stop story. Stop saying that. Let's go. Hey, this is the year everybody's finishing stories. Let's go. Gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> why can't Why can't Carlito finish his story? Why can't our truth finish his story? Our truth did. He got to he climb up that ladder and grab that world that tag team title. He finished the story. Let's go. He even teamed up with his childhood hero, John Cena. Let's go. Even CM Punk is finishing his story, taking down all elite wrestling. Let's go. You sure CM Punk is finishing that story or Tony Khan's is? I mean, depending what perspective you're looking at, yeah. <laughs> bra, 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 mate, because we're, we're too busy grinding into the playoffs. Let's go. Bro. We'll have, we'll, we'll have, we'll have spray. <laughs> Which, by the way, we're finding out he was told to say that, bro. Bro. By the yo, and, and you can tell he he was told to say that because Jedi. Let me ask you something. You ever heard of a of an assassin with a machine gun? No, they don't use machine guns. Too much noise. Exactly. And then how's he gonna put a cut a promo on the cerebral assassin? Yeah. Tell me where that makes sense. Bro, 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 bro. <laughs> It's funny because we were doing that that month that rest the WrestleMania watch along. They didn't. All oh, right, all right. Don't take shots at AEW. I mean, I was telling you the future. I th yeah. I simply told you your path. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, don't get mad at me if you follow it. <laughs> no, yeah. I'm, you know that's your problem. You wasted two hours of your life every. Yeah. Wednesday. It ain't my fault. I read the street signs. Mixed lead is cut to 14 with a minute remaining. McBride pushes it ahead. Hartenstein with the ball. Hartenstein. And they call an offensive foul on Hartenstein on the drive. Uh. I 
alley you to Cornet and Cornet hits it. He was never doing stuff like that on 19 Jedi. No, it was a stiff, but he just missed the uh, layup though. The, the rim blocked it. The rim turned into Mikembe Mutombo. And the Knicks just got a five second violation on the inbound. I mean, that's, you know. Yeah, that was a good promo back in the day. Hawk and Animal. And White Boy hits another three. 116 to 107. What was that? You would have probably called Tibbet like, what was that when I used to put you coming from the bench? Knicks passing it around ahead. Man, they having a hard time getting the ball. Yep. They get it up the court, though, as Bogdanovich gets the layup. That should pretty much do it. Richard takes a three, hits it. With 30 seconds to go, they want to check to see if it's a three or a two. Yep, it's a two. Oh, they got they got they're fighting here. They, there's this still a clean. This still a two possess three possession game here. Yeah, we're already putting our feet up, but no, wait, wait a minute. DiVincenzo, nice crossover, gets it up court. DiVincenzo, over to Bogdanovich, back to Devo. Devo over to McBride. 15 but, seconds left. McBride over to Devo. His Knicks are just killing time. Yeah, that's it. That's it. It's over. All right, take a breath. There we go. Nah, it, it's um agent. Don't go too hard on them. Um, I'm not going too hard, agent. You know why? Because this is game eighty of a long yeah. season, and they were up by thirty. And they were yeah. just, you know, I'm not gonna they were say up by thirty. Yeah. And like, this is the thing: if there's if there's ever a chance for these end of the bench guys to find a way to get themselves a contract for next year, it's this moment against the tired bench of the Knicks that can't substitute their own G League players to match their energy. And not only that, um, Agent, yeah, up by 30 to 9, but that's like, yeah, that was scored against the second unit on the deep bench. You know, yeah. um, the, the Celtics deep bench got nothing of really, those guys want to at least put something on film to show Masula that you, in, in case of an emergency, you could use me. So I'm not going to go too crazy here with that, um... You know, it, it, it it's just a it's just a win. You know, yeah. And uh, Big Ty says, Agent Argo, it wasn't a comment towards you. He just w saying in general, he takes the win. So of course, I, we I understand, but I hope Agent understands as well uh, with that. Um, yeah, it they they get that. Um, I get it. I know you want to tighten the screws up, and really wanted to put on a dominant performance there. But l you know what? Letting them get some false sen sense with the third unit or the deep bench to put some runs. It's okay because then they won't be steaming when they play the Knicks. Well, we got embarrassed. We were killed and they don't, you know. So I, I'm looking at it as a psychological bound. But let's put the graphic up indeed. Let's put that graphic up. We are playoff bound. The train is coming into this, ready to leave the station for the Larry O'Brien run. We want to ask you guys to, those to get on and join the train, the playoff train. Once the playoff train leaves, no no bandwagon jumping nobody no no ticket for you so you gotta get on board before the playoff starts and let's ride it all the way to the larry o'brien trophy let's go let's go and we ain't leaving to the midnight train to georgia no we're leaving to the midnight train to larry o'brien let's do it leaving on the midnight train to larry hoo -hoo. <laughs> I'd rather live in the championship world without none. Who, 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 who? We're leaving. Uh, on the midnight, midnight train, train to Larry. Even on the midnight train to championships. Who, who? <laughs> yeah, all, right, all right, that's enough. That's enough. I know you, know, you will. Copy right over here. Yeah, Jenna, Jenna. There's a copy right over here. I know you will. I know you join us. I know you will. Let's go. Let's go. No, serious aside. 
Good win for the Knicks here on a Thursday night. It makes everything feel good. Tomorrow's going to be a good feel good Friday morning because we're going to wake up feeling good. We got the Brooklyn Nets tomorrow on a back-to-back -back, um, with a lot of implication there. We got to just continue winning our game, putting pressure on Milwaukee because then they have to they have to go and win out win their next game against OKC. And then it gets all dicey on... on Remember, the Knicks do not have the tiebreaker on the on the Bucks, so they finish with identical records. We lose out that tiebreaker, but if we're one game better, we will clinch that second seed. So Milwaukee has to then lose the next two. The Knicks got to win the next two. They will be the second seed. Anything else on on any combination? One win by the of uh, the Knicks go you know one and one. Milwaukee goes two and zero oh, or even one and one. Milwaukee will get that second seed. So the Knicks got to go 2-0. Oh. Milwaukee has to go 0-2. Oh we'll be the second seed. Um, of course, the first seed, the, uh, the third seed, Knicks got to win one of one of, uh, one of of two. And even if uh, Orlando goes one of two or um, who's behind us? Just Orlando, right? Orlando's behind us, one of two. We, yeah, we should, yeah. We'll, be, we'll, we'll clinch the third seed. Knicks win one game of the next two. They clinch that third seed. Um, and if they lose the next two in a row um, and – Orlando has to go 2-0 and and so forth from that. And there'll be so many different tiebreaker situation there. But, man, what a good one there. Yeah, you go. They got the train emoji going. Good win, man. Likes it. Aaron Brown likes it. Let's go. Man, let's go. This is great. Let's, you know what? We haven't had that. There you go, man. And we have to add you on the wrench, man. There you go. Get a wrench. We handing out wrenches tonight. Absolutely. It's, to all of us there, indeed. And, of course, we got a couple more games left. And, of course, we know we haven't done all season, but we got we got two. We're going to have the last three games. We're going to put that graphic, the overlay, to all our Nick fan membership. That's a little bit from last year, but we still, oh, once once a Nick family, once a Return of the Jedi family, you're always a family member. And, of course, all those are our main, main staples there, of course. Let's go. And, of course, we appreciate everyone that's joining us here. All right, Chef Dan. We win. Let's do this. Let's say good night because we gotta break. We gotta go make those donuts on a feel good Friday, yeah. and of course, and we'll be back on for the Knicks and the Brooklyn Nets. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to share. Hey, if you can help us spread spread the word on social media on the channel, man, we really can ask that. We really could use that. Although you guys have been doing more than enough all season, we appreciate it. But let's continue to go higher level in the postseason. We got some great news. Coming up in the near future, before the season's out, we'll, we'll, we'll review it as well. Um, you guys will be excited about it. We got some great news. So we have a good night, a blessed, beautiful Thursday into Friday. And, of course, it's weekend time, baby. Let's do this. Yeah.